While the FDA and Health Canada recommend 60 milligrams of vitamin C per day, vitamin C guru Dr. Linus Pauling recommends 18 times as much for optimal health. Dr. Pauling is the only person to have earned two unshared Nobel Prizes. Following his own advice, Dr. Pauling lived to be 92. One orange contains about 60 milligrams of vitamin C. Rather than eating 17 oranges a day, Dr. Pauling just took regular vitamin C supplements. Oral vitamin C supplements deliver only 20% of the vitamin C into the bloodstream, so ingesting a 1,000 mg tablet or capsule will deliver about 200 mg of vitamin C into your bloodstream. A direct injection of 1,000 mg of vitamin C will result in the absorption of about 700 mg of vitamin C into your bloodstream. Liposomal encapsulated vitamin C is absorbed at a rate of at least 80%. In other words, 1,000 milligrams of liposomal encapsulated vitamin C will result in the absorption of at least 800 milligrams of vitamin C into your bloodstream, even better than direct injection. And you can make it yourself in minutes for pennies. For those who can't stomach high doses of traditional vitamin C tablets or capsules, liposomal encapsulation is an efficient way of megadosing on vitamin C without ingesting large quantities of ascorbic acid. Here's one way to make your own liposomal encapsulated vitamin C. You'll need a measuring cup, a blender, a tablespoon, a wooden spoon, an ultrasonic cleaner, distilled water, ascorbic acid powder, soy or sunflower lecithin, and mason jars. Start by adding one level tablespoon of ascorbic acid to half a cup of distilled water. Blend for one minute. Keep this mixture handy in a glass. Now add three level tablespoons of lecithin to one cup of distilled water. Come on. Blend for one minute. Pour the lecithin and distilled water mixture into the ultrasonic cleaner. Now add the ascorbic acid and distilled water mixture. Turn on the ultrasonic cleaner and let it work for 6 minutes. Stir it about once every minute with the wooden spoon. The ultrasonic cleaner will probably turn itself off after a couple of minutes. When it does, just restart it. Now pour the whole mixture into a big bowl. Don't try to pour it directly into a mason jar. Oh, you son of a this recipe will fill a typical sized mason jar. The mixture will become unstable after three days if not refrigerated, so keep it in the fridge. A good health maintenance dose is 1000 milligrams or one tablespoon a day for an absorption factor of at least 800 milligrams.